Real Sociedad manager Imanol Alguisel was ecstatic with his side after a 0-0 draw against Inter, which sealed their place as group leaders in the Champions League. La Real topped their group for the first time in their history, finishing level on points but ahead on goal difference of the Italians. Alguisel has seen his side progress year on year since he took charge, and after returning them to Europe's premier competition for the first time in a decade, they have come back in emphatic fashion. That's exactly how they have done so, Alguisel credited his players. The key is having very good players, who go to death with the coach's idea. Then you have to have them, your balls, in the right position to play and take risks in a stadium like this. A coach is nothing without his players, and it shows when your players go to the death with you. I don't think we are aware of what we are doing, of what this team achieves. It will probably take us years to realize what this group is doing. Making history in a stadium like this and against a hell of rival like Inter, getting into the second round and first in the group. It's incredible. Acts to sum up their performance in a word, Alguisel has bursting with it, as he told Relevo. I have nothing but pride. Let us not forget that Inter is the finalist of the last Champions League and that they played at home, in front of their fans. We still do not realize the value of what we have done. We wanted to be first and we leave with the regret of not having won, which is what we wanted, but the merit of these footballers is priceless. It is clear that Inter also had their chances, but I would highlight our personality, a personality that we always bring out, not only here, but also in the Copa del Rey matches we have played this season. La Real surpassed expectations, as has become customary for them to do so in recent years, with Inter coach Simone Inzaghi admitting that at the start of the group, La Real were favorites to finish fourth. It means a favorable draw for Real Sociedad, who are back in the knockout stages for the first time since 2004, where they lost 2-0 on aggregate to Lyon, courtesy of an own goal from Gabriel Schurer and another from Junin.